Right, welcome everybody to another video, another eat. Well, actually, sorry, let me start this over. This is your boy Bishop Down. Welcome to another eating, another video, another look. And we are doing a little um, lunatic slash um, group synergy video. Um, and we're just going to do a demonstration on the, um, we're going to do a, a, a money run. I did a couple of them, and um, so I'm at 10 million right now. I think I started with like 2 million, 2 or 3 million. I did like a few. So, um, um, like I said, if you need to get um, gold or get, uh, just check out my video. It's called Get Get, and I'll just show you how to do So I'm using my own methods, um, taking my own advice. And right now we're in the process of building up this group right here for our money run. So um, I got my four main characters here, Joella, Melissa, Nagi, Philalili. Um and uh Zer Zer Zero Zero and Hozika Hozuki Hozuki. We don't really use them, they just sit back there to hold the gold weapons um to get the bonuses or whatnot. So um the goal is to get everybody to have a get badge of uh, 8% or higher. Currently, Iwella has a 30%, and I think there's a couple of 5%ers in there, and like one eight percent But um, so again, if you look at my weapons here, this uh, Lance of Gold, that gives you like a lot of, like 25%, I think, bonus. So everybody's got these right here, Gold Katana, Staff of Gold, Sword of Gold, Axe of Gold, Gold of Gold. So, um, and uh, so when we look at the synergies, let's get into it. So, and also, um, I guess what I realized by, you know, just playing and stuff like that, like when you're getting your groups together, you have to kind of see how, you know, which things work and which things work together to help uh, best synergize your group. So you got a nice little balance and um, everything goes smoothly. Because the one thing I don't like is trying to run a dungeon and it takes forever to kill a mob, or even to kill a boss. So we're gonna run in here to the ethereal, take our money, six TMT team, the money team. Okay, so let's uh, run around here and get this done real quick. I uh, just wanna show kind of what I do here. So there's a few ghosts and goblins here. So, uh, there's three guys here. So I'll start out with, um, Nagi and I just do a cosmic wave. Um, just to kind of show you how, cause I don't have a character that can do any preemptive one kill, um, mob, one hit mob kills like a, um, like a Hardy or a, um, a Tsubame or a Kyoko. So, uh, so if I'm not using Nagi, I'll use um, Thizzle Lily. I gotta set up with the uh, sublimation. And then I go with a glint glaze from Melissa. So it's kind of like a cross attack and boom, they're out of here. So that's just a, a, a thing that kills all the enemies. And these guys as well is the same. We'll use uh, Nagi at this time for a cosmic ray. You should wipe them, dump them out pretty quick. And this just makes it go by a lot faster, and then you don't have to worry about, um, as you switch between, you don't have to worry about using all your uh, magic points or whatnot. If I see an iron giant, I'll probably just use uh, Nagi, because her cosmic ray is pretty strong. We'll just knock off these guys real quick. Then we're going to take out the horror. And uh, there's two ways that I can use to take out the horror. Um, we could either use the attack force or we can use um, uh, Thilly Lee. Because she's still strong now. That's why she, they still, still got to rank like 95. Because she still got some power. Um, I wanted to use the Gojin sword on her. But I don't um, have it yet. I haven't completed the quest. Um, 
I just haven't killed the uh, the horde. So uh, the first way we can do it, um, and I, I'll show the attack force uh, in the next fight. But so basically, Tizzle has a sequence that she does. Um, usually, it's going to be um, like voice strike, and then soul of horrors, and then uh, lunatic mode, and then eclipse. But since these uh, horrors are not very very strong. I can just kind of skip that and we'll do like a, a three a three turn. So we'll do voice strike to set up that. And then um, uh, for Nagi, we'll just use her or her Varados. And then pretty much everybody else is on defense. So we got Alloy Shield from Melissa. And then um, Iwana, she's going to do this uh, Esto Perfume, which gives um, a barrier. Uh, reduces damage 30% to all party members uh, one time and restores all thousand. So an alloy shield, an alloy shield gives um, all party members plus 15% um, physical resistance and shade and thunder type resistance 50%. So we'll use that. Now the Voredos also also does something as well too. So there's you know there's a reason why you do the uh, pick the moves that you pick. So the Varados that we just use, um, it's just a water attack on all enemies. It increases damage if target inflicted with pain and poison, which they weren't. Um, but the water types attack of all party members um, is plus thirty percent, and crystal type plus thirty percent as well for three turns. Um, so that's going to be good for. Um, if I use Melissa or whatnot for Glint plays, but I do that for Nagi's Cosmic. If, um, cause we're gonna go ahead and do the Cosmic so to, to weaken down this, uh, this little whore here. So, uh, Philly still have to go through Lunatic, so we'll let go of the Lunatic. We do a Glint Glaze, and then the Glint Glaze is gonna give more because it's gonna give, um, um, wind slash crystal resistance minus fifty percent. So that means that uh, if she gets it off before Nagi hits her mark, then um, the crystal resistance is going to be minus fifty percent and physical resistance minus thirty percent. Which one turn, which is going to help for the Lily's um, eclipse strike, right? And since we're in the uh, flash strike zone. Uh, type attack of all party members plus 30%. So we're going to hit that. Uh, the Glint Glaze, we already got that. And for Iwella, we'll do this one for actually, uh, we're going to do Lunatic. Yeah, so Lunatic, so this one right here from Iwella helps as well. It does the power of all party members plus 10% and intelligence plus 10%. Um, the critical rate of all party members plus 100% during the next action. One moving critical damage plus 30%. So that's going to boost everybody's uh, attacks for the next turn, which would be, uh, most importantly, it would be a uh, Fiddle Lilies. So we'll attack, Cosmic Ray, so that worked out pretty good. We got attack there, but we got a little defense, so we don't have to worry about Nagi dying. And now we should do the Eclipse, and that should take um, this mob out. We'll just do a little Cosmic Ray for insurance. And another Glint Glaze there. Just for a little bit more assurance. Ooh, it didn't kill her. Almost took her. Usually it kills her, but you know, we're not using strong enough weapons. So we'll just do another Eclipse Blade and that should be it. Everybody can go. Usually it kills them, but it didn't kill them that time, so that's fine. But um, you kind of get the picture of kind of what we're uh, trying to accomplish here. So we move over and uh, cosmic ray, cosmic ray again, Nagi. And you just have to understand when you're playing this game, sometimes everything doesn't work the way that it's supposed to work. It's like some things aren't a hundred percent. So you just have to realize that when you play. Because sometimes I've played and I've had um, Melissa in the group, and I didn't get the, her flash strike stance. It never came up or it didn't work in the uh, attack force, which is really annoying because sometimes you're counting on that, but I guess that's why you get to play multiple times. Um, 
in, in such things. So, so just be aware that um, it's fine. It is a game, so you know there's flaws. It's not perfect, but it is fun. I like the video. So we're gonna he stepped up to the plate. So we're not gonna use the attack force. I saved the attack force for the last boss because I wanted to show uh, how to use the uh, lunatic in here. Um, one, 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 one. Let's see. Tanagi so is asleep. That's fine. Uh, lunatic for her. Nefus. We don't have Nagi because she's sleeping, and I don't have anything to stop her sleep. So that's fine. We'll do that. Doing this one, we'll do the phase eclipse. Let's see what we can get down here. Same process, though. Same process. We got enough defense, so it'll look good. Oh, Nagi has ran out of magic. Arg! Everybody's running out of magic. That's no bueno. That's not good at all. So. Let's use a couple of different things here. A little attacks from her. And let's see if we'll be okay. This one quick plays. Oh, Oella did her thing on that one. So she'll build up. That was basically from that net, that net from boost from um, Melissa. Gave us that extra juice. So Nagi didn't have any. Um, she's got 61, but that would be fine. The Lily doesn't have anything. That is not good. We have a costume where we can use. We'll use that to knock off this last mob. Now, the good thing about attack force is um, when you're in attack force, you can use moves without magic because it doesn't cost any magic. So we're going to jump into this final boss here and um, kind of try to describe what we're trying to do here. So in this fight, we're going to, the plan is to use, or show how you can use the lunatics in well. You, you can use lunatic while you're in attack force. And that's another thing to remember. Um, I just thought about it a minute ago. And it, it, what it really does is it helps you to boost your attack even more um, without having to use or waste a turn to go into lunatic mode. Um, this works really well for uh, characters like uh, Eva, um, I think Clarte, and uh, maybe some other um, uh, characters that already that already that have like two lunatics, like uh, Phila Lily, Lily's um, her um, ES form. She has two lunatics, so if you because once you go you know three turns and it's over. So the best way to do it is while you're in lunatic. So you don't lose a turn. So we're gonna to try to do this as fast as we can. We're gonna start out with um, our middle buffs here. Um, then we're gonna to go to four turns in the middle buffs, four turns of the um, main attacks, or the powerful attacks. Then we're gonna go back to the lunatic and then finish out with the powerful attacks. That's the plan. So let's see if we can do this. I gotta press the buttons fast. Here we go. Okay, lunatic mode, lunatic, lunatic, lunatic. Okay, go back, go back, go back. Now this is all happening really fast, but um, you can see swirl. I think everybody got lunatic mode in. I'm not sure. But that's kind of an example how to do it. Because you can go ahead and get your buffs in, get your main attack, and then go back to the lunatic to boost your main attacks again. Um, but that's a good way to, to uh, you know, practice it, see how it works. I'm getting ready to... Um, I was trying to practice that. Let's see, let's see if I might be able to go to another one here. But I didn't do that. I didn't get her sword. Okay, we got some good matches. All right, so that's how you do that. So um, I'm going to attempt to run a um, another one here. Not of this one, but something uh, different. 
So just bear with me as I go through this here. Uh, I'm going to see how this works. So I'm going to go here, parties. And I'm going to go out of that party. Let's go to Power Down. Get yeah, Power Down. I'm going to switch her out with Thilla Lily. And then uh, Pizzica, I do want in the group. Do want piece of in a group. I'm just gonna change a couple of weapons here because I have a feeling I've done this a couple of times, but every time I've done it, somebody died. And I was trying to figure out how to change it so nobody would die. Um, speed four. Melissa. Fine. Let's move over to Nagi. These guys are trying to get chains in. Uh, Nagi, she has a golden staff. I'm going to give her the this one right here that we got. Uh, I'm going to change the get badge to an intelligence badge. Uh, bam. We're going to go over to Philly. We're going to change her sword of gold. Izuku has that one. I don't really know. It's kind of Probably the sword of gold is just as strong as the fire spirit because I haven't got what I'm calling. Um, Annabelle's sword, but she's got Annabelle's sword because I haven't got the gold gem blade yet. Um, I'm not going to worry about the Octane stuff because she's a character that would be used for the uh, Kick It team. So I just leave her in here. Um, see, how, see how this works. We'll see how this works. Um, um, one thing you can do. Um, when you go to Sebastian's lab, if you don't have an attack force, if you need an attack force, we're on this right here, the, the trial of the perilous type. So this is the group. I already beat this one, but I was trying to beat it without using um, without anybody dying, I think. What are the details here? Uh, oh, this says clear one with one or a few another style characters. Oh, that's what that was for. Hmm, okay, well, we might go to this one and just go see how this one is. Because I haven't done this one at all. I don't know who the bosses are. Let's see, 10 points, two ones, clear, we get a power badge, water type with this, two, it's clear, it's few, clear was four or fewer party members. And yeah, I might go back and do that one. So, um, let's just see how this is, but I haven't tried this one before. A little power down group. Let's see. I think there's four ways. So let's see if they gave us an attack force. We got the flash dance. Um, okay, we don't. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to quit. And I'm going to go back to it to start with an attack force. So you can always do that if you need an attack force real quick. Go to Sebastian's lab, start one, quit it. And then when you come back, you'll get an attack force. Uh, okay, let's see how this goes. I don't know. Like I said, this is all experimental. Okay, there's your attack force. Uh, I got Pizuka in here, so our goal is to keep Pizuka alive. And I think I know how to do it, so here we go. I'll do a little slow to make sure I get those. No one take it now. This straight attack can utilize that flash strength. Last drink. Now, Izuka does get like this causal thing. Um, it's like one of her stronger attacks. It builds up. So I'm not going to do anything now because one of these guys has an HP stopper, as you can see. Um, you always have to recognize, or just try to remember which guys have HP stoppers or not, because that means that, of course, they only going to take a certain amount of damage. Then once they do, they stop. So um, that's kind of why I save it. So we got Pizzica singing now. So my goal now is to make sure that Pizzica stays alive because they will be probably attacking her. So we're going to start with, um, I'm gonna start with uh, uh, some defense here. Some Reagan there for her. Um, because we got Eva here and she may just kill the, the Orc Baron with the Icicles. So I wanna make sure I don't want to use the, I want to save that. Um, and then for, um, I do an alloy shield as well for, uh, 
listening to me listen. Okay, so that's what I thought. She would kill it with the icicle, so I don't waste that causal so I can save it. Now, the twins here, the twins, or these two twins, the org twins, they do have HP stoppers. So, recognize that. So, we're going to start on this one, target him. Icicles there. We're going to do, uh, we already got the alloy shield up. So, I'm going to do a Nephilim boost as well. And then from her, I'm going to go ahead, easy come, going to go ahead and hit with causal. See how much damage we can do. Oh, wow. Wow. I did not know that was going to happen. That is amazing. One hit. Wow. So now we're in the third wave. Wow. That's amazing. Now this guy right here, the blue guy, he's a pain in the ass. So um, let's see. I think that means he's going to resist that water. So we're going to use crystal magic instead. Um, I really, no, no time for plant plays yet. But we still got that up. We're going to uh, do some fireworks on this guy. He's resistant to that, but we'll do that. And then from, we'll do the joint glaze on her. For her. So we still got those in this land. The crystal do magical damage. Okay, that's good. Aqua ball taking some damage. I'm surprised we killed the twins like that. Very, very surprised. He's a still So... Oh, somebody died. Oh, Melissa died? How did she die? She must have been poisoned or something. I didn't even see that. Wow. Well, that's not cool. How the hell did she die? I have no idea. Very upset about that. So what do we do? Nagi or... um? Man, that's not cool at all. I'm going to put uh, Nagi in there. I didn't even see her go. See, that's the weird thing to me. And sometimes it's like, how do you miss that? That is crappy to me. I didn't even see her go. So sad to see her go, though. Okay, so Pizuka wanted to start singing the heal. So Pizuka to be healing. So we can get that attack force up. And hopefully we will use that. Or well, maybe we don't have to now. I don't know. This is a weird fight. I'm going to have to do that again. Because I didn't even know my girl died. I don't even know what happened. Anyway, cosmic rays everywhere. We're gonna smash this guy. Icicles. Hopefully. No. I mean we didn't smash them, which I don't know why. God, this game's weird sometimes, man. Anyway, uh let's see how this goes. Um so what's her uh what's her name? She's out of her uh lunatic now. So what I'm just trying to do now is build it up so I can use the lunatic again. Uh, bam. Okay, so we got a full bar now, and this is the last boss, but we don't have our flash strikes dance. Why? I have no freaking idea why. It's dumb. Okay, so obviously this is a water guy, so anything I do water is not going to affect him. So that means only crystal magic. And Izuka's got the fire. Oh, that was dramatic. Oh, yeah, that was very dramatic. Ouch. Uh, so I want to wait for Pizuka to stop singing before I do this attack force. Um, we're low on health. Very low on health. So I'm going to do a couple of heals here. Clay here. we got a full bar, so we'll do... The cosmic ray from Nagi. Oh, that's not good. Oh, good. There we go. Come on, piece of good. Wake up. Time to stop singing, girl. Good bonus is there. Magic. Okay, so um, we lost somebody. It sucks. So I'm going to go ahead and activate the lunatic, but what I'm going to do, like I said, there's a full bar here. So we're going to do the same thing. Um, we're going to go buffs, main attack, back to lunatic, and then uh, finish out. So let's see if we can do this. Okay, one, two, three, four. Okay, lunatic now. Come on, lunatic, lunatic, lunatic. One more lunatic. There we go. 
We got a full bar there, beautiful fuel attack force bar. We're gonna use Izuka's because she has a really great um, Regan and Hill and all that stuff and all that stuff, so just to help us stay alive. Um, so we activated everybody's lunatics. So everybody should be stronger in this case. I can't believe we lost Melissa. Like, how? Okay, I'm losing some battery power. Look, I'm doing this video on a low battery. So, okay, so Pizika is now singing in her Rhapsody again. So, we got max power. Everybody's only ticked up. I'm going to go ahead and do that one. No icicles, just crystal. Well, they're resist he's resisting ice and crystal, but he's absorbing the, uh, the water. So, we want to do no water damage. Oh, man. This guy is strong. Now, mind you, I don't have, like, I may have, like, one or two grosses on these guys. Nothing crazy. We still got uh, Fiddly, but we're not going to be using her Cosmic Ray again. Um, let's try to get some Fire Magic on this guy. Uh, and back to that. Attack Force is building up nicely. We may get another one here. We may need it. We'll be Seems to have some good defense going on. Some good, great Reagan, some Regan, Reagan, Magic stuff, Pizza still some. Uh, another Cosmic Ray. We're going to do some of that Fire Magic stuff again. Another Dragon. Okay, Cosmic Ray. Ooh, we got another one. Ooh, vicious. 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 Okay, Nagi should be, Pizuka should be doing singing again, ain't she? Yeah. So, same sequence again. We're just going to, uh, no need for lunatics, so we're just going to one, two, three, four of those, those little hills. I'm going to come back in here. Oh, shit. I'm doing the wrong one. I'm still doing the wrong one with the icicles. See if I can get this Cosmo out. Yeah, one time. There it is. Damn, damn. One more, baby. Not doing as much damage as we want. So we definitely gotta finish this fight soon. Pizza is still singing again. Rap City, so we got max power, cosmic ray. Uh, we'll go back to fire, magic, and crystal again. Looks like we're gonna win, but I don't know if we're gonna do it. Obviously, I don't think it's 15 turns, so I gotta figure that one out. But thanks for watching with me, guys. I was just uh, doing a little test on here. It went a little bit overboard with the time, but that's fine. Watch at your own leisure. We should put an end to this, hopefully. Oh, my gosh. Oh, my gosh. Just go away. Go away. No, 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 icicle. Go away. Go away, please. Finally. Man, oh man. That took too long, but we did beat it, so we cleared this one. But I'll go back and visit and see what else. There's other stuff we can get, so I know we didn't do it in 15 minutes. But anyway, so it's clear. But anyway, guys, thanks for watching. That's it. But remember, like, you know, synergize with your groups. And you can use lunatic and attack force. All right, well, this is your boy, Bishop Down. This has been another Eden, another video, another look. All right, I'm out.